Welcome to another Getting Started with Concrete 5 video. If you haven't already, go watch the intro to Concrete 5. It'll help give you some context. Right now we're going to talk about some of the built-in design features of Concrete 5. Uh, we originally intended Concrete 5 to be used by agencies to design and deliver great websites to clients that would then go manage them for years uh, without much help. Uh, but there's a lot of ways you can design your own site if you've just got some DIY energy and you want to uh, spend a little bit of time seeing what you can do. So uh, we'll start from the bottom up. You can put the page in edit mode and click design on any block in the page. And from there, you can try to override the styles in that block. Now, a lot of the options that you have here may or may not work, depending on the type of block and the type of template that you're using. Uh, but let's just see if we can change the text type and make it really big so it's obvious what we're doing. There, you can see we changed the uh, type size to be 44 pixels instead of 12, and now that's huge. Uh, so you can do inline designs, and you can apply those designs to blocks or the entire area that a block goes in. And you can kind of make blocks of colors and put borders around things and do that that way. Uh, another thing that you can do, of course, is change the uh, actual theme this page is using. So if I click Design from Edit, uh, you can see here are all the themes that are installed. And I can preview what this page would look like. And if I like that, I can go ahead and hit Save. And that'll change the theme for this page. So now any pages I make underneath this page will use this theme, but the rest of the site will have whatever theme settings on those pages it had. Uh, you can do some stuff centrally with themes as well, of course. So if you go to Dashboard and click on Themes, here are all the installed ones. And if the theme developer has set it up, you can actually override some of the styles. So uh, let's change this header logo color to, I don't know, blue. Uh, we can say OK, give us a little preview, you change the background, make it look more clear what we're doing. Yeah, that looks great. Hit save. Now we've customized that theme. And if we want to jump back over to uh, pages and themes and activate it, this will apply that theme to every page in our site. So when we come back and hit reload, there you go. There are changes that we just made. Uh, also, of course, you can browse our marketplace of themes. Um, just hit get more themes, and if you've connected to the community, uh, you'll be able to get uh, always changing rotation of exciting new themes. Some of them free, uh, some of them cost something, uh, but always you can just download, it'll add it to your project page, uh, automatically put it on your own website for you, and with just a couple of clicks, you can have a completely new theme on your website. And we can apply it to every page here. Give ourselves a festive holiday look with uh, just a little work. So there it is, just some basic ways to get started with theming your site uh, with Concrete 5 quickly and easily. <laughs> 